Okay. I'm gonna sit in the chair and interview real quick. Okay. And ask a few questions. Ask me some questions. So, how long have you been going to Fairfield? Uh, two years. Two years now. And uh, do you did you play any sports throughout your course at Fairfield? Uh, yeah, I ran for the university. You what? What do you guys country. cross country? Yep. Track? Any track? Uh, no, not really. Uh, what That's about in high school? Team. High school, did you play any track? Yep, I ran cross country and track. Excellent. Yep. Um. So. Do you you join the film program here at Fairfield? Yep. Why? Why? What was? You, what kind of? Did you uh, do film in high school? Yeah, a little bit. How long have you been going to Fairfield University? Uh, two years. It's my second year. Okay. It's probably gonna be like a jump cut. Yeah. Whatever. Um. And I ran for the cross the cross country team here. Um. Uh, in the film program. And I did film in high school, and hopefully someday I'll be a big, bad director and take the world by storm. Okay. Okay. I haven't been there in a while. Good. I live in New Jersey now. Okay. Why? Uh, you go, that's where I work. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. Are you friends with this Phil character? I am. You are? Mm -hmm. Wow. You're a senior? I am. What are you going to do next year? Uh, actually, I'm going to the city. Really? Moving into the city, yep. To do what? Apartment. Uh, my dad actually might be opening a bar in Manhattan. Really? So it might be bartending. Do you have your bartender license? He's just going to teach me. So, Neil, this is just some behind the scenes footage. Um, Dan just stepped out. He's going to come back. When he comes back, I'll have him come in and uh, sort of shake hands with him, see how that looks. Um, like we said, maybe we'll have a second camera rolling on the beginning of the interview when before Bob comes in or Todd or whoever it is we're shooting. Um, and we'll have him come in. He will uh, He'll meet the... Gail or you, whoever's interviewing, shake hands, and uh, this kind of will be the forum. The frame you're seeing right now, super wide, see the lights, come in, shake hands, and then sit in the chair. So uh, we'll wait for Dan to get back, and I'll cut and uh, show that. Just another note, we got a Kino flow back here, the tube, the two bank, and then I got another Kino flow here, sort of filling in this face a little more. In our key light, this four bank Kino flow shooting in here. Um, these are outdoor balance. It comes with good uh, indoor balance tubes. So depending on where we're shooting, which is key, we got to get on a location. Got to see that location before we get there. Um, maybe we could do that the 20th or 21st. And uh, Dan, just a sec. Stay right there. And uh, make sure we see what kind of light's going to be coming in, what kind of light we might have to match that's already existing, especially in a kitchen. There might be uh, fluorescent light, so something to note, something to check out. Um, so you got your backlight here, your fill light, and your key light here. It's pretty simple stuff. Um, it's just a matter of setting up and, and using it, and then camera is simple enough. I'll show you how to use that later. And so, Dan, so now, Dan, just come in and uh, shake hands with me and sit down. We'll go right into sort of like we're going to do it. Anyway. So, how's it going? How's it going? Good. Um, yeah, we're just going to sit here and ask you a couple questions. And okay. We'll get started. Uh, all right, so, if we were doing an interview. Um, so, this is the setup. Now, I'm going to go back. Yep. Um, probably less headroom. Uh, this is pretty good though. Let's see how it looks. Blocking wise, Neil, this is your department. I mean, Neil. Neil, this is your department, Neil. Well, here. This is Dan. Dan Dunn. He's going to be working with us. Dan, hello. I'm just seeing how uh, the eye line looks differently. Obviously, you'd be facing me, but. Uh, is good. All right, we'll cut there, and then I'm, I'm gonna have you do the same.
and they're gonna just cut me uh, if I don't finish it on time. It's it's pretty basic, but uh, again, like I said, the model Phil, uh, it just wasn't fitting him. They made me put feathers on the shirt, but I didn't like them because who wants to have feathers on their shirt? Why uh, peacock feathers? Why? I mean, I don't know why you put peacock feather feathers on them. Maybe for like a mating type uh, scenario. Um, if you wanted to give off that aura, Do you that think you're gonna win against the other competitors. I definitely gonna win against the competitors. There's no doubt about it in my mind at all. What am I gonna do after this? Uh, after this, I'm gonna go and storyboard some stuff and get a bite to eat. Probably at the Stag, uh, the online. I mean, the on-campus grill. On Fourth of July, usually, me and a bunch of my friends get together. Uh, at someone's lake house and go boating and shoot off fireworks and all sorts of other good stuff.